What Halloween candy is the best Halloween candy? Part two. Let's plop in. Hello and welcome back to the Potty Mouth Show. Guys, today we're going to be tasting some candy and drinking some alcohol in a segment that we call Shooting the Shit. Shooting the Shit. Okay guys, this is day two of the Halloween candy face-off. Last week on Friday we had the first eight out of 16 candies go head-to-head -to, -head to come up with the first final four. Reese's Cups, Starburst, Peanut m m Peanut m ms and Snickers. All right, so now on to the next eight candies. Today we have Jolly Ranchers going against Kit Kat, M&M &M going against Sweetest Fish, mm. Reese's Pieces going up against Skittles, and Twix going up against Almond Joy. Now, like I said, we are doing this because we disagree with Good Mythical Morning's Halloween candy thing. And they said that Almond Joy was the one that kind of had the Cillerunda, Cillerunda, Cinderella story. I can't speak. Yeah. Cinderella. <laughs> Cinderella story and one. It's a Cinderella. <laughs> so we already are a little, we already are a little bit drunk, and we're gonna keep drinking, and we're gonna get to our first candy. Drink first. Absolutely. <laughs> the first candies we have are Jolly Ranchers. Jolly Ranchers. And Kit Kats. Ooh. Okay. Let's start with Jolly Ranchers. What was your favorite color growing up? Um, I was always green apple myself. I'll go blue. Blue? Just because you got green. Okay. Let's do it. <clears throat> Maybe. You know, I already don't like this candy. <laughs> it is very good. It's good. I like Jolly Ranchers. First of all, Takes a long time to eat these things. Yes. <laughs> so, um, can Jolly Ranchers though hold up against Kit Kat? Hold on. Before we do that, we gotta cleanse. Okay, clean the palate. Yep. Alrighty. <clears throat> so, which we've had these recently we have. in the sweet versus sour. And they really, ooh, it was pretty. They, they held up pretty well. Oh, yeah. Let's do it. Double teamed you. Hmm. <laughs> All day. All day, every day. Kit Kat is moving on. Next round, we have Swedish Fish Ooh. versus m ms Meow. Uh, you want to start Swedish Fish first? Sure. Okay. <clears throat> I haven't had a Swedish Fish in a long time. I don't think I ever have. I don't hate it. It's actually pretty good. The flavor is really good. I don't like that it sticks to your teeth. That's the only downside. Oh, so that's why you don't like licorice either. Yeah. See, I know I know him, but these are good. I do like these. I think I like the flavor <clears throat> more than the texture. I would agree. Yeah. So, okay. But, will it compete against M&M's? I actually have to drink. <laughs> it's stuck in my teeth. Right. Oh man, it's still so much. Yep, mm -mm. I hate these. <clears throat> Alright. Which, hold on, which color do you want? They're all the same. It's a candy coating, not flavor. Which color do you want? I'm grabbing a handful. Let's do it. Three, two, one. Click. Yep. Mow Mix, please deliver. You're good. Got um, some M&Ms. These are really good. 
M&M's have to move on. These are good flavor wise, but they stick to your teeth and they're just like a pain to eat. So for that reason, the M&M's tastes good. M&M's is moving on. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so next candy we have Skittles versus Reese's Pieces. Mm. Which one do you like before tasting them? Do you like both? I I enjoy both. I haven't had these in forever. I know what Skittles tastes like. I want to go with these because I don't think they can beat Skittles. For really? me, for me you personally, don't, you don't think so? I don't think so. Right, but we'll give it a shot. Yeah. I'm gonna give me six of them, just to give me a good... I'll take one more. Make it fair. All right, ready? Three, two, one. They're really good. They are good. They're so good. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> I'm trying to stay unbiased because we've been eating a lot of chocolate. <laughs> it's not any chocolate at all. I know it's not. It's a chocolate coating. Candy coating. Okay, well. Now we have. These aren't bad, by the way. These are, hold on. These are very good. Yeah. I do like them. But they are fantastic. Yes. But can they hold up to Skittles? Skittles are my childhood, dude. So let's let's do it. Ooh, I'm gonna give it a best shot though. I don't want a bunch of oranges. I got a little bit of everything. I do too, but I want to make sure like balanced. Alright, ready? Ready? Three, two, one. They're so tough. They're gonna put too many in my mouth. <laughs> Which one do you like better? Yeah. It's so hard to pick. It right? really is. But man, there's just something about Skittles. Like, oh man. That rainbow. We're tasting it. And it's telling us to put it in the next round. <clears throat> so therefore, Skittles is it. They're winning and they're moving on. <laughs> All right, guys, the moment you've been waiting for is finally here. We are going to determine if there really is a true Cinderella story at heart. We have Almond Joy and Twix. I want to start with Twix because I know what a Twix tastes like. Okay. And I want to give this the best shot it's got. All right. Do you want okay. the left or the right? Surprise. I'm left-handed. Let's do left. I got two rights. Here we go. Left. Two rights don't make a left. Can. True. Anyway, let's have a Twix. Hold on. Oh, yeah. Trying to be fair. Trying to, Trying be. to be fair. All right, but I know what a Twix tastes like. Like, I don't remember. I need to bite into it. Man. <clears throat> I like the right side better. <laughs> My the caramel stuck on mine. Mm -hmm. Oh, that burned my nose. Mm. I was good candy bar. Twix is ar arguably one of my favorite bars. <clears throat> it is very good. Not it's not my favorite. Yeah. I don't know why. Is I. It, it's not my favorite. So I always, I base candy off of my mood. Yeah. Okay. That's fair. And really what's around. I gotta clear my mouth. All right. The 
moment of truth. Ladies and gentlemen, let's find out if Almond Joy really holds up as what they say they do. I'm gonna bite the part with the almond in it. I was gonna say, I was like, what the? Yeah. No, Why no, do you have one almond? These are the snack size. The bigger ones have more. Still though, yeah. you're gonna have one almond. So I'm gonna bite like right here. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I'm going to as well. Ready? You got, you have to. Let's do it. What? It's actually pretty good. <laughs> Hold on. Hold on. And that is very good. And I don't like coconut. Bro. Hold on. That's pretty good. I don't know how to feel. The yeah. almond gives it that nice crunch. And then the, the coconut isn't super strong. It's I thought I thought biting into this, it was gonna be like punch me in the face. See, I thought so too, but it's just subtle. The thing of it is, it just needs a little bit more almond. To me. Right, and that's the bigger ones do. We bought the snack size so we could fill these up. Yeah. But the bigger ones but, have more almonds. And I think I think if I bought a whole a whole almond joy, I I mean I need the whole thing. It is good. And here's okay. I don't like coconut. And you don't like coconut. No. I got my answer. I'm going to almond joy. I am too. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, let's see. The Twix is just super heavy. What? The Twix just is really super heavy. This is super light and fluffy and it's it just, more refreshing actually. It's for very a refreshing. Bar, for a candy bar, it's pretty refreshing. Guys, the Cinderella story is real. So far. Almond Joy is moving on to the next round. Wow. Holy cow. Okay, so we have the final eight candies and we will be putting all of those head to head next week and we will crown the victory candy. Dude, I cannot believe Almond Joy actually pulled through. This I is a great candy. I can't believe I actually like it. <laughs> and you really hate coconut. Yeah, I was, I was expecting not to like it whatsoever. So make sure you guys come back next week to find out the final conclusion for Almond Joy. Thank you guys for liking and subscribing. We'll see you guys next time on The Potty Mouth Show. Let's drink, brother. Yeah.